DJ Pocket Free Release First Prize. I think the better option will be Creator Combo plus two years of DJ Care Refresh. It's like 744 euro. Be right back. I'm gonna watch some reviews. How the image looks like. I don't need. Time to sit down, watch some DJI Pocket video, one after another one. This video is gonna be very specific about this camera and my thoughts. I'm gonna compare it to my GoPro. Low light looks kind of nice. Table because of the built-in gimbal. For me, what's important is like from this to this to this to this. I have this front screen on this camera, and for example, in GoPro I have front and back. I'm interested in how fast it will be switched from this to this in pocket see myself or with i love gopro that i can just put it like that and it's stable but with pockets um, you can knock it over you need to connect one more thing to attach tripod and with tripod and with this one more thing to attach tripod this camera is going to be much bigger first review potato jet it was okay didn't learn that much the mic is pretty good that you get from creator combo and what talks about this this case could be tripod but look at this it has had it so big when you want to put a tripod mm. otherwise we always need to keep it in your hand okay, let's go to the next review pretty good review i love his like humor it has like a lot of personal things that he adds great channel next video iphone edo fast charging 80 percent in 16 minutes not really worth it to buy the eight or pack for the battery but the wide lens you get this wide lens with the combo eh. okay nice. fast charging nice how big it is with main camera things to attach and tripod Let's watch this one. This mic is amazing. She shows the wide angle lens, but... Ugh, come on. I'm gonna lose it. We'll always wear it or not. Again, decision. Flipping heck wide angle lens. It's not waterproof. I mean, my, my GoPro also. <laughs> no, it's a deal breaker. It's a little bit sad. And sand and dust. Do I need to be careful with this, with the moving screen? Now this guy, I always look, makes funny faces and thumbnails. He makes quality videos, let's check this one out. Triple tap this button. Or like this one, three taps. Why not like one? I hope you can change this, tapping this button to make it faster. That's the that I will use the most, just like changing the waltz lenses from me to what's in front of me. Three times tapping this button could be irritating when you do this like a lot of times a day. That's my quick thoughts. Okay, that's the how that's it's gonna look most of the time. Tripod, tripod extension to tripod and the camera. Hmm. Price is uh, creator combo. This mic is amazing. Without any like connectors, transmitters, it's connected to this camera. Light quality is stunning, and you, and you don't have flares. An iPhone that will be like full with like this flare spots, but low light looks amazing. And he talks about the important topic, which is this is not really that wide lens. The main and without the wide lens filter, it's not really that wide to like vlog nicely. That would be amazing camera to just record what's going on, on the streets. Like there's a lot of those channels that just walking around towns. Oh, for example, here Leon, the guy is just walking around with camera. I think pocket would be amazing for that. Beautiful. Maybe that will get me more views. 500,000 views just walking around town. Hey, yeah, equipment he uses. Oh, yeah, Pocket 2. Pocket is perfect for those kind of videos, and guys is using Pocket 2. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, now I really want to buy it. Let me show the Japan. Yeah, Pocket 2 again. Wow. I need to find a job and make money to buy this pocket camera. Okay, let's go back to reviews. Another channel, Jamie Connect. I really like them. Look at the comparison between Pocket 2 and Pocket 3. Wow, the difference is huge. That's Pocket 3 low light quality. Oh my God. Minimum focus distance. That's so important. Thing in GoPro, it's like 30 centimeters and DJI Action 4 was 30. I mean 4 and 0 and GoPro 3 and 0 because sorry for my pronunciation. I'm not gonna buy this camera now, maybe later. It's too expensive. I would prefer like spend money on new iPhone. Oh no. <laughs> God, I think I have a problem. Basically GoPro wants me to buy a new camera. By force doing that, the battery should work, but I don't let there's just the battery, I can replace it easily. So why the tripod mount it's not with like the base model? You have to have pocket extension and then tripod active track, cool. 
iPhone quality is really good. You don't need new camera. Every single YouTuber recommends this camera. I'm interested how many of them are going to actually use it. This, this guy show it in the best way. You have a camera, this thing to connect to a camera, tripod, protective case. It's not longer small camera. I would love this with small somehow tripod to where I always have this case with you. It depends what you want probably. If you want to work at night that would be amazing. This is me of this wide lens. Thinking about it. Should I use it or not? Maybe. Best video about pockets there from official DJI channel on YouTube. It's beautiful. New day. How much stuff you have with this creator combo? It's no longer a small camera. I mean, if I could, I would buy. I'm not gonna lie. Especially this mic. The low light is pretty sweet. The low light is amazing. Oh my god. Actually, I watched every single review on YouTube in English. Time for videos in I don't know what's the language. I don't understand, I don't care. The difference. GoPro and this camera. Pretty big difference. Uh, Tokyo camera, thank you, guy. I watched so many reviews. 1000 views, so random channel. He's comparing everything in one video. iPhone, English speaking YouTubers are so lazy. Most people, if they have a good phone like iPhone with Samsung, they shouldn't buy this camera. It's not gonna use it when you have always your phone in your pocket. But on the other hand, this DJI would force you to film more because you have specific things to film. I'm learning something. iPhone is like 24 millimeter lens, pocket 20. Oh my god, this video is gonna be long. Sorry, but I'm camera geek. And I should finish this. It's like next the morning. Should start filming, I mean, next vlog for this day. Enough. I'm not gonna buy it. I love the mic. I love the low light quality, especially when you're walking. It's stable. I don't like that you have to buy creator combo. It's not that small with everything. It's fragile. I, I, I'm scared of destroying the gimbal. I don't know what I'm saying. See you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. You don't need new shiny camera. But if it's gonna force you to film more, buy it.